Hello, today I will be demonstrating how easy it is to set up Omron's A2W wireless push button. If you see here, I have one receiver and two push buttons. These push buttons are wireless and batteryless, so every time the button is pressed, it generates its own power. This is important because maintenance is not required to replace batteries. Looking at the push button, you'll see that there is a red LED. This indicates that I'm not currently connected to my receiver. To connect and register the push button, I slide the mode key into ID mode. I select the channel I want, for example, channel two. I hit the button one, two, three times. I will get a green indication here. Then I can move back into my test mode and you'll see when I hit the button that I'm getting an output on two as well as an LED green confirmation light on my push button indicating a connection to my receiver. If you want to actually trigger the output, then I would slide this into my run mode. I can also program one push button to multiple channels or outputs. So if I go back into my ID mode and I select channel four, green LED light, slide back into my test mode, and you'll see now that my button is connected to two channels or two outputs and I'm getting a green LED here. If you want to add multiple buttons to a channel, this is also an option. So I slide into my ID mode, I select my button and the channel I want, one, two, three, green light here, move back into test mode, and as you can see, both buttons are triggering channel four. To delete the channels on a push button, again, slide into your ID mode, select the DEL or delete option here. Take your button and hit it one, two, three times. Green light here, back into my test mode. You'll notice that I get a red LED here and no outputs are being triggered. This means I'm not connected to the receiver. One receiver unit has a total of eight outputs. So we do offer a PC tool to assist with the programming. In combination with the E58 CIFQ2 and E58 CIFQ2E conversion cable, you can connect to the front of the receiver and then connect to your PC with the USB port. Each button has a unique ID, and this is visible in this free PC tool. So now you've seen how easy it is to program Omron's A2W wireless push button. So go try it for yourself. Visit omron247.com for more information.